The exciting part about fat grafting to the breast is that it continues to evolve and every year plastic surgeons get together and we report our results. We discuss our results. We discuss the controversies of results, particularly around this new subject of fat grafting to the breast. And the take home message this year for me is that it's not cosmetic versus reconstructive fat grafting anymore. It's fat grafting to the breast and the people who benefit are both cosmetic and reconstructive patients. We are adding fat to soften and improve the soft tissues of the breast to make it look more natural, typically surrounding an implant or oftentimes. And therefore, if that was an implant placed for a mastectomy or an implant placed for augmentation, uh, it doesn't really matter. One of the great advances that has made large volume fat grafting, fat grafting that's used to not only reshape, recover, and soften the appearance of the breast, has been the use of something called Brava pre-expansion. It's a large volume suction device that patients wear prior to surgery that gets the breast in a mode that is able to receive the fat more reliably. The discomfort commonly seen with mastectomy patients is routinely improved with large volume fat grafting done along the lateral chest wall. It's been one of the more uh, not only rewarding, but one of the uh, results I can deliver with confidence to patients and it, it originally was not even the reason they were coming in. It's a bonus, if you will, and may soon be one of the best bonuses, one of the best priorities.